Hi, John. It sure does. I spent every summer vacation in Ocean City, Maryland as a kid. Ocean City is under a full evacuation order right now. A major hurricane actually created the Ocean City Inlet back in 1933, and locals in particular are really in constant fear that another whopper of a storm could pretty easily wipe it away. I managed to wake up my poor dad this morning who's in the Baltimore area. He's glued to the news reports there to give us a sense of the Preparations going on and uh, the feeling there in the Maryland area. Dad, can you hear me? I can hear you, Lauren. Good morning. Good morning. What? Ha First of all, are you ready? Are, are folks in your area uh, getting ready for this storm? Well, I guess I'm. A I am. I uh, went yesterday to the uh, local store and bought some ga batteries and uh, uh, made sure my flashlight was working and my radio is working and bought some water and some non-perishable food and. Uh, of course, it was very crowded. A lot of the shelves were starting to get empty. Uh, the usual things like toilet paper and bread were starting to walk off the shelves. So, yeah, mm -hmm. I think I'm ready as much as I can be. Fortunately, it doesn't seem like it's going to be hitting Baltimore as badly as it's going to be eating the eastern shore. You were looking at some video of that right now, uh, some of the folks evacuating uh, out of Ocean City. Can, can you touch on that at all in terms of uh, folks trying to get there and get, get out of there to, to board up? Yes. Uh, well, as you know, where we spent uh, many summers um, is uh, right in Ocean City, and uh, I spoke to your uncle, my brother, and uh, they cannot get into Ocean City since the uh, governor and the mayor there have declared it an evacuation area. Um, they're in a uh, high rise. It's uh, 16 floors up in the air, and the exposure from the windows is uh, is the vulnerable point. And uh, I understand that the uh, people who the, the condo association is making provisions to board up the entire building if mm -hmm. they can get to it in time. Um, but they can't get down there, neither can uh, your cousin, Joe, who has a place in Bethany, which is not too far away. They have a home, and uh, obviously they can't get to it. So they're just keeping their fingers crossed. Mm -hmm. And uh, as many people who can't get in to do the boarding up, uh, we'll just have to wait it out and see. All right. Well, Dad, that's just about our time. Thanks for uh, waking up and uh, joining us this morning. As you probably heard there, the uh, Red Cross from our area is headed your way. So uh, folks in Maryland really bracing John and Roxanne for the worst. I'll certainly keep you posted throughout the morning at the Live Desk. Back to you.